Oh yeah, what up motherfuckers, it is Chris, the Random Blind Guy, here from Hot Wheels Car Culture, Dutch Land. I still don't know how to say it. Here I got the Porsche 911 GT3RS. Everybody likes the color, I like the roll, I like the heaviness, metal on metal, side mirrors really cool feels super smooth in hand I think this is based off the 2011 Porsche really cool casting really good roller like I mentioned in other videos some Hot Wheel premiums do not roll good at all a 50 50 chance ladies and gentlemen and uh, depending on what area of the country you're in this might be one of the peg warmers um, here in San Antonio the peg warmer of this set is that 90s Mercedes I think it's a 94 I don't even like it to be honest with y'all I have it that's why I haven't showcased it. I'm kind of debating if I should showcase it or not. This has already been in the toolbox. And if you're new to the channel, my toolbox is where I keep all my favorite stuff. All the other stuff is kept in bins. It's all loose. And it all gets dinged around and all that. So I do want to put that out there as well. For all you collectors who collect like me, congratulations. <clears throat> I'm just staying in my lane type thing, you know, everybody kind of does their own thing as far as their collection is concerned. Some people put it up on the wall, some people buy doubles, triples, quadruples, some people never open their stuff, some people open it, some people play with it. It's all, uh, it's all based on the individual's preference. And it's always going to be controversial too. It's kind of annoying to be honest with you, because, uh, uh, it's like, well, why do you open them? And then some people's like, well, I op like me, I open them. I open everything. And and uh, some people think that it's more valuable and this and that in the package, out of the package. If something is valuable, it's going to be valuable no matter what. Period. In or out of the package. I don't care what anybody else has told you in the past or anything. But if something's going to be valuable, it's going to be valuable no matter what. You can buy a car that's all scratched up a red line or whatever and you can pay top dollar for it but also you have to keep in mind that you know you come back to let's just say the uh oh that tesla cyber truck you know that that thing was going for crazy on ebay of course, uh, so that's what I've that's what I've seen on 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 you know what different people have said. Come on, What's up, brother? Catch y'all later. All right, bro. Just a little. Uh, everyone knows me around here. <laughs> Anyways, but uh, that's my little tangent, guys. From uh car culture <laughs> here i got the hot wheels y'all read the title porsche 911 gt3 rs so whatever you do with your hot wheels i ain't hating on you man you know matchbox and all that uh you do what you do you do whatever makes you happy and and uh, uh just keep collecting bottom line and and uh stay awesome you know what i mean stay awesome let everybody kind of do their own little little thing 